guys. We've arrived, we have the flowers. Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome to a new vlog. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. I feel like it has become so standard now for me to start the vlogs on a Monday when our new cook delivery has arrived. They should definitely sponsor me because they literally get like the first few seconds of the vlog, which is very important because that means that almost everyone that watches gets to see this. So they are getting like proper prime placement on my vlogs. So you cook, if you happen to watch this, I feel like you might as well just start sponsoring me. Even if it's like you giving me the stuff for like half the price, that would be appreciated. But I mean, you can definitely sponsor me and give it to me for free. Just saying. But the meals we have this week, this is what I ordered. Did I not change my meals? Hmm. Okay, anyways, <laughs> let me show you guys. Guys, I look so crusty. I need to wash my hair, like just the leave out. I'm going to be removing this this weekend because it's like the fourth week now and I feel like I cannot stand the itch anymore. But I ordered, this week we actually have some beef. So we've got barbecue beef and potato mash. I've noticed a lot of the meals now on you cook actually have like potatoes and mash. I don't know, maybe it's because it's winter. Mm, that will take us 35 minutes. The next one is a simple beef me meatloaf with baby potatoes and a fresh salad. So that looks like that. It's also 35 minutes. Then we've got spicy ginger chicken with banhook chili oil and jasmine rice. And then it's also got, what is that? It's got some baby marrow, I think. Yeah, baby marrow. Or some people refer to it as courgette. And then we have the West African beef skewers. And these are 30 minutes. So all my meals this week... I can basically choose what I want to eat first because I have two cook in three days and two cook in four days. So maybe today, since we're looking at three days, then like this. Maybe we should start with the meatloaf today. Then we have the chicken tomorrow. Then we have the barbecue beef. And then we have the skewers on thursday um i might not i might actually not have dinner at home on wednesday and thursday and then i think friday as well i hope this vlog goes live will this go live let me not say what what we're planning to do because then i don't know if this vlog is going to go up before sunday or on sunday but you guys will get to see what happens on friday so I'm actually only going to manage to eat two meals. If I don't manage to eat the others, I'll eat them on Saturday and Sunday. They should still be okay. And yeah, let me just unbox. What a long intro, but I hope you guys are enjoying the multiple uploads. It's just you guys are not really watching. I don't understand why. Why you guys are not watching. But in the old vlog, I showed you guys this little trick of getting an oil burner and like some essential oils the house definitely smells good i just have one burning here one burning in the bathroom which then goes out like into my room so i'm just gonna pack these into my fridge and then i'm gonna take this box down to my um storage till they come next week so that they can collect it because it just takes up unnecessary space in my house which i don't like but yeah let us pack these
back. Today's Tuesday. It's currently quarter past eight. I've showered. I went to the gym this morning. Quickly got back, showered before my eight a.m. Um, load shedding slot. I do start work at 8.30. I'm just not sure if my laptop is charged. I think that was the first thing I was supposed to do after gym because yesterday my power left and it didn't come back. So I even went to spend the night at my sister's because we had the load shedding from four to six. It came back at like 20 past for about two minutes and then left again. And I was just like, you know what? I know it when this power does this, like it's not gonna come back tonight. And apparently it came back again at nine for a few minutes and then tripped again. So thank God I went to my sister's cause then I was able to shower for the gym this morning. And at least I spent the evening with some lights. I am still waiting for my inverter. I already paid for it um i signed the contract they're supposed to come connected because it's supposed to connect to my giza because my giza is gas so that means whenever there's load shedding i'm unable to shower unlike some people where your giza is always hot mine is never hot it only heats as i shower because it's gas just like how a gas stove and a gas heater works so it only heats up as i shower which is great because then obviously it doesn't eat up like electricity but then it's a disadvantage when it comes to load shedding. I mean, I can deal with like maybe not having power, but then not being able to shower is like, I can't do multiple things. And I know most people always say, oh, why don't you just go to the gym and shower after I cannot work out without taking a shower. I'm the type of person that sweats a lot. So it's just very uncomfortable for me. And I just don't feel comfortable like going to the gym without taking a shower. It just feels, ugh. And I would not be able to like, work out as hard as I do when I've showered. But I thought I would take this time out just to quickly unbox with you guys um, the stuff that I got from Sheen. You guys obviously saw the bag that I've been using, which is this one. I'll leave it in the description box once again. But yeah, I like it because it literally looks like a YSL dupe. I'll like try to put a picture here of the actual YSL bag that I'm talking about. And yeah, it was quite cheap. It was like a hundred and something, I think, which is quite good because it fits quite a lot. And I guess it's going to do the job for now um i do feel like when i do get over this tassel here i'm just gonna like clip it off and then be left with just this part here but so far i like it not bad um yeah it came still in good condition so i got that one because i'm trying to like switch up my bags and then i got another one as well that i'm not really so sure about but it's this little white bag here and it says cult galoid i didn't actually notice that it had writing on it i mean it's not so bad but well you can't really see yeah it's not so bad but i kind of feel like it's just annoying and i don't really know if i'm feeling like the silver zip but i'll also leave the description the link to this bag i think it's quite it's got quite enough space especially like for night events when you don't really wanna carry a hectic bag or you can put it on your hand like that i don't really know how to carry it but i'll test it out and let you guys know if i don't really like it i'll put it on my yaga so i got that and then um i got this thing here for washing when you wash your hair because apparently this is good for like um getting like circulation on your scalp and it also apparently works for hair growth so I got this. I'm gonna try it out when I remove my leave out. I'm planning. I was going to remove it this week, um, but then I'm having such a busy week that I won't have time for my hair. So I just decided I'll remove it um, either Monday or Tuesday evening. I'll see. So yeah, that's what I got. And then I got a couple. I think two of these striped jerseys that are doing their rounds. So I got this supposed to be a jersey but now it looks like a top i don't know how this is gonna fit i got it in a medium i think now i feel like i should have gotten a large but maybe it will look nice with just like some pants and sneakers like tight pants oh i know what it could look nice with so i got these other pants from cotton on which are sort of like flared sweatpants so maybe this could go um and then i also got it in a different color this one seems a bit thicker than the black one yeah this one is more of like a jersey well it's still almost the same but 
I was hoping that it would be a bit longer. Maybe we'll see when we've put it on, but I think it looks cute. Um, one person that made me really want to buy these is Singo. I'll put like her Instagram here because like her fashion sense is very nice. So I saw like her, I think she had, was it one or two outfits with this? And I was like, I'm definitely getting it. Um, I think I'm going to get different ones from Sheen. I'll try this out and definitely see if I should maybe get them in a large. Um, but I'll decide. But I think it's quite good quality in terms of this one. Like it's a bit heavy. It feels very nice. This is definitely going to be hand wash. I don't think I want to put it in the washing machine. But I like it so far. I'll let you guys know when I wear it. And then I wanted to try out their sweatpants. Which I'm also not sure about because I don't know if i really like the material it looks like that material that collects like the round bubbles but i got it in black they look a little small because i was scared of a large i got it in black and in white and i got the white again because of single so i saw her wear white sweatpants with like one of these jerseys but now this is not gonna go because this is not white it's actually cream and this is actually white but maybe if i put like a white tank or something but yeah this is what they look like i hope they're not see-through i've got the nice fuzzy material i hope they actually fit like i really hope that they are also long enough because i like my pants like high-waisted and then like pretty long so i think that was about it in terms of clothing no actually i have one more little cute outfit i had purchased something similar in gray but it ended up being too big for me and i gave it to my sister because obviously she's got like bigger bum than me so i got this cute little two-piece just for indoors sort of like a skims outfit you know just for days where you don't want to go out you can just put this on or even in the summertime you can wear this put a blazer on top and have like your dad sneakers with a pair of socks and a cap and it looks really cute and then i wanted like just a nice bag to be carrying around because like my laptop is quite small so like if i decide i want to go work from a coffee shop or something like that i just wanted like a cute bag that i could use this i will be honest it looked different online when I arrived, I was like, mm, okay, maybe I should have ordered something different. And then the one thing I liked is that it came with like a little makeup bag for the inside where I can keep like my makeup or I can make this into a stationary bag, whatever I choose to do. And then I purchased these things that people use. These things that people use when removing makeup or washing your face just so that the water doesn't like run down your hands. I did ask Kia more to let me know because she was like she sells them. She didn't come back to me. Hi, get I was like I'm being impatient, so I got these and then it also comes with a hair one so you can like tie your hair back, put these, wash your face. Maybe I should have gotten a darker color now that I think about it on days where I have makeup. But I'll just see how it goes. And then um, I had gotten this because I thought I could put it underneath my counter. It's like these little lights that you stick. I thought they were longer. So I got two of them. And the nice thing is that it's also a sensor. So you can put it on auto where it senses someone's movement. It did sense the other day when it was on... Um, I don't know how it senses movement but it did sense the other day or maybe it senses when you walk and it's rechargeable which was one thing I liked because I hate having to buy things with batteries like yeah I hate having to buy things with batteries because then when they run out like what do you do and then I got this thing which was for sealing stuff that you've opened like if you have plastic stuff and it's also chargeable and um you just like run the plastic on there and then it seals i actually haven't tried it 
I don't know how. Okay, it's on now. So I don't know how it actually works. Let's see. There's a plastic. Oh, let's try this sheen one. So, like for example, if you've opened a packet of chips, you would then. Okay, that didn't work. I don't know. I'll figure it out and then I'll let you guys know if it actually works. Because so it's just like I'm so tired of having bags sometimes like open and then stuff gets dry and then like you have to throw it out. So yeah, that was my little purchase. I have another sheen order that's coming maybe this week or next week. I'm not sure when it will be delivered, but I'll unbox that with you guys as well. Most probably in the next vlog. I wouldn't want to have two sheen holes with you guys because you'll get annoyed, but... Yeah, I'm just going to quickly get dressed, find something warm. Hopefully my laptop is charged and then we can start working. So I'll pick up the camera later. Good morning, guys. It is a lovely Wednesday today. The birds are chirping outside. There's a little bit of sun coming into the apartment. You know, we're live. Um, so that's already a good start to the day i mean we woke up we're blessed um my face is still a bit swollen waiting for it to come down but i finally what's the word i finally gave in and got myself an inverter because i just can't do this whole load shedding and the four hours it's just messing up with like me trying to be productive especially with work um so yeah at least if i have like two or four hours i'm still able to use my wi-fi i can still join my meetings which will be great and then as well as i mentioned i'll still be able to like use the giza so they're coming in today i'm actually going into the office today um but thank god i'm only going a little bit later so it just so happened to like work out in terms of like the timing they were coming to install and the timing that I need to go to the office so I'll be going in a little bit later so this week there's only going to be one vlog in the week and then one on Sunday and this is Sunday's vlog Thursday's vlog is already up and ready um, so I tend to like edit in bits and pieces during the night people like ask how do I do it so like obviously I film like bits and pieces during the day it's not like I'm spending my entire day filming and then every night I try to like edit whatever I can a couple of days before the vlog so that by the day the vlog is going up it's like ready so I've been since now I've been filming like shorter vlogs it's easier for me to kind of like edit and get over one vlog in an evening like when I'm having dinner or after dinner I like set aside like maybe an hour or an hour and a half and I manage to like edit get it done um and then upload what's also been helping me is that i got a hard drive so i'm able to edit like multiple videos at the same time so for example i could be editing tuesday's vlog but already starting with thursday's vlog if i already have content so yeah um they're coming to install i'm really really hoping that they can install it in here because my dv board is in my passage so and that's the one where the electrical sockets where they have to connect it and stuff not this one if it was this one it'll be easier because then they'll just put it up and then store it in here because i think it's easier to store it maybe like at the bottom there or if it's not too heavy at the top um so that it's covered in here and it doesn't make a noise but i don't know if they'll be able to pull it all the way up there's like a little bit of of what do you call that thing trunking or whatever you guys call these things electricians would know but yeah, i'm really hoping they don't have to put it in my bedroom because i'm not going to be able to sleep those things are noisy so i'm waiting for them i hope they're on time because i need to fix my face and to also just finish dressing quickly and then i'm gonna head off to santon first because that's where we're meeting and then we'll head off to the office so yeah <sighs> mm, guys say bye wait i can't see you i'm going to work she's vlogging for me 
I'm house, I'm house sitting. <laughs> I'm house sitting and making sure that the inverter is installed. There's a lot going on for this inverter to be installed. Hey, it's a bit too much, but yeah, I just came in my Crocs. I'm gonna work here. Okay, goodbye, ma'am. Okay, let's see you outside so we can show them your outfit. You look cute for work today. Show us your outfit. I can stand in the little corner there with your bucket and your mop. Closer, so yeah, let's start with the hair. Um, the hair is Ali Pearl, right? And then, okay, we love the, the earrings. Did it. The earrings are from no poetry. Ooh, poetry. poetry. My phone is ringing. Hold this. Oh my god okay all right so sorry guys i had a call we're finishing off her outfit because the girl is late for work and we don't want her late for work because she gotta secure that bag for us okay the it, real bag the real bag <laughs> her real bag her full-time nine to five okay yes. and then the blazer is mango mm -hmm. the dress is primark france <laughs> And then the stockings and the shoes are worn. Nice, love it. So this is what she actually looks like when she goes to work. Her nine to five. Yes. Her real job. Usually in black. Always. She looks like a boss. Boss bitch. Yes. Okay, bye ma'am. Bye. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, actually I should be welcoming myself back to you guys because I'm back from work. Um, well I've been back for like what, 30 minutes now? 20 minutes 30 minutes i don't know anyways huh okay over 30 minutes but because we didn't feel it because we're part of the inverter gang now you know we have power at all times <laughs> yeah i'm so sorry for you guys that still have to be in the dark when it's like load shedding in the evenings but what is that <laughs> Like, load shedding? Who is that? Who is she? I'm joking, guys. I still need to figure out how to connect my Wi-Fi. And as soon as I've done that, yo, 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 yo. Like, yeah. So anyways, they, Tandy was here. I don't know what else she vlogged when I was not here. We'll have to check to see if she really did a good job. Guys, I did something different with my makeup today. And I'm so happy about it. So, like, my sister told me to stop baking my face, and I didn't bake today. So, I used, I also got, like, one of those triangle uh, puff, powder puff things from TikTok. TikTok girlies are never wrong, because look at my makeup today. Like, I like it. Tony, my makeup looked good, ne? No. You're lying. Stop being jealous. Anyways, I used the powder puffy thingy um, and I think it looks good and obviously with my Laura Mercier and yeah, I just need to go collect my other concealer, my Christian Dior concealer from Master Star. She's blessing me with a Christian Dior concealer. But anyways, yeah, uh, I'm about to make dinner and this is the meal for today. So we have chicken, spicy ginger chicken with jasmine rice i think and it says it will take about 45 minutes so i guess i should start now just so that i don't um eat too late and because i have a busy day tomorrow i don't think i'm gonna vlog it with you guys because i feel like if i vlog it's gonna take me longer to cook i'll show you guys the final product when i'm done but yeah this is the meal this is the meal this is the meal how cute like literally i love my makeup and like this hair I, i'm still like in awe of how it still looks so good one month later please tell me like this lady it's literally this is the fourth week and the fact that i actually even washed it and like the weave didn't move Ashem, this lady does her job she knows how to do her job now i understand why usimo's hair always looks so nice uh -huh. ne? like the way this looks it looks exactly how i used to look with my clip-ins no yes. when you saw me today and the fact that like i'm saying i washed it and it's not like all over the place all right guys i'm gonna leave her details in the description box don't overbook her because now if you're overbook we're gonna struggle to find slots to go do our hair <laughs> but yeah guys like tell me this doesn't look nice one month after doing it like 
you you tell me but anyways let us get cooking so it's like today was the same i don't know what it is about when i apply makeup but i feel like it makes my eyes look whiter i don't know if it's just me but anyways escom decided to take their power back which means i can't make the meal i was supposed to make today because now i can't use the oven so i've had to make a meal that doesn't need the oven thank god i have one so i'm going to be having this um barbecue beef and potato mash please tell me why they only gave me one potato but i guess that should be enough and at least i have avocado for a salad and excuse me this is my beef here today's meal is good because it doesn't have onions like i've been collecting onions from my you cook meals let me actually show you please look at all of this because they tend to give you like a full onion every single time you have a meal and you usually like use half so i'll usually use half and obviously if i like keep using half i take the one i didn't use the day before and i use it so these are the onions i've collected from you cook i'm literally going to give them to my helper when she comes she's supposed to come today but because i had to go to the office i was not going to be able to lock up when she leaves so I was just like, you know what, it's fine, you can come next week. Um, luckily the house isn't too messy. So I was just like, it's fine, I'll clean like over the weekend. I did manage to like clean last night because I knew they were coming to fix the inverter and I was just like, you know what, I actually wanted to be clean. I actually just figured out I can actually place the inverter behind the curtain so at least it will be a little bit hidden. I mean, it won't look the best, but I think it will work if i really want it hidden i can place it in the other direction and hide it um and i think it should still be able to get some fresh air so let me quickly cook because i don't actually even know if this thing fully charged and if it will last cook take a shower and then sleep and hopefully still have enough power to be able to shower in the morning because i need to shower in the morning but yeah guys the life of lashes is so nice my sister was even looking at me today i think she was in awe like is that really my sister um, but yeah, she kept looking at me and I was like, I know, it's the lashes. They do this thing. Like, I don't know. And also a nice simple pair of earrings is nice for work. So always just get yourself like little huggies. I remember when I first fell in love with little huggies, I didn't realize they'd become like my favorite, favorite pair of like earrings. Finally found them in Santon. This is a five. I think it's tight. So I'm going to size up like everyone said. Hey guys, we meet at the same spot that we're at yesterday. I literally just got home. It is past 10 and we have load shedding once again, but because we are part of the inverted gang, we don't feel it no more. Guys, I showed you guys, I didn't have my camera today, so I just took like a little shot when I was at the Adidas in Santon. Let me tell you a story. So my colleague wanted the Adidas store now. So I was like, okay, let me escort you because she doesn't really know Santon very well. So I was like, let me escort you because we're coming from like um, uh, Santon Sun side. So obviously for her to like figure out how to get there was going to be a mission. So I was like, let me take you. So I took her there and she's looking for her stuff. And I'm like reluctantly just walking inside. And this guy comes to me and he's like, oh, do you need any help? And I'm like, no. I'm just walking around, you know, like bored. And then something just says, just go check if they have the Sambas. But part of me was like, mm, I don't think they have because, you know, they've been sold out. And then on my way there, like, this guy was literally knocking off. And I just asked him, like, oh, hi, do you guys have, like, the, uh, do you have small sizes in the Samba? And guess what he says? Your lucky day. We just restocked today. We just received stock today. He's like, if you waited, you are going to regret it because these shoes have been selling out like hotcakes and then he's like to me he thinks this is the last restock that they're getting i don't know maybe that's true maybe it's not but anyways i got a pair for me and obviously the other girl that always gets everything like me so they come in this and everyone was right you have to size up so i got a uk6 a usual size five 
but yeah these are my pretty sneakers sambas i got one for me and a pair for my sister i'm so happy so i think we're gonna uh match over this weekend and yeah hopefully they're comfortable i just hope she comes and she tries them on so that hello uh -huh. hi yeah so this is what they look like so she needs to come and try hers on so that she can make sure that they're the right size if not she needs to go change them because they are very narrow so you hear that they're very narrow so you, you should just come make sure hey because you don't want to then try it on and then like it's a bit tight because like when i tried the five i was like mm -mm. so you just want to come make sure so that it's not a tight fit but yeah guys i'm part of the cool kids gang now i can also you know and i've seen like a lot of nice winter looks with these shoes actually so yeah i'm so happy and guess what guys i think was it this yeah it was in this vlog where i was telling you guys i'm gonna show you guys some outfits that i saw from osimo wearing them and i obviously didn't have them but i was just like i'm gonna find like a different sneaker but i found it so i'm so happy so happy we're gonna wear it we're gonna match match this sunday now oh and guess what apparently tandy was also searching for them this morning she tried to check them out on shelf life but when she finally made it through they were sold out so it's so weird how me and her literally always think alike i always say it's so weird i think my sister and i were meant to be one person and god was just like you're too awesome to be one and then he divided us into two you know yeah so yes literally she was trying to get them she didn't tell me i didn't know because i was working the whole day so literally when i went into we're gonna have two pairs of each and then have to return one um so yeah i went and i purchased and also the nice thing also if you've never purchased or signed up from adidas if you go purchase in store you can go sign up and get like a 20 percent off um voucher which you can use on the purchase of whatever you're buying so i was lucky enough to get a 20 percent off which is super nice so yeah just thought I'd update you guys. I'm going to remove my makeup now because I have an early morning tomorrow. My day starts at 9. So I'm going to have to leave the house at about 8.30. So I think I need to wake up at around 7 or just before 7 so that I have enough time to like get ready in peace. And guess what guys? I'm going to have load shedding in the morning. But guess what? We can shower. <laughs> this event literally came at the perfect timing because I was going to have to wake up at 6 or before 6 to shower. And make sure that everything's ironed but we don't have those problems anymore anyways my hair is so itchy guys i can't wait to remove this i feel like when i remove this i'm sure i have so much dandruff on the inside but anyways i've been talking for five minutes see you guys tomorrow bye hey bestie i'm in your apartment i know you're at work um thanks for the key it does come in very handy um i know we both thought of this idea at the same time which is crazy because i do think we we're supposed to be twins is there some sort of dark shadow on this side okay, i'm gonna put this yeah yay i do say we're supposed to be twins did i just get this She's gonna hate me if she figures out I was messing with her camera and I left it in a weird way. Okay, so anyway, thank you so much for the gift. I love, I love, love the shoes. Thank you so much for finding them. I appreciate that I didn't have to spend my own money. You know, always being a big sister and having to spoil your little ones is really hard. And I know um, she hates it when she tries to spoil me with stuff and I pay her back the money. So this time I am not giving you back the money i am not i will accept this as a gift i appreciate it thank you so much love you so much i can't believe we literally thought of the same thing yesterday and you won you won this time um it would have been very weird if we both had two pairs of sneakers and we didn't know what to do with them well we could have run a raffle on instagram to sell the other ones for an additional like fee because nobody can get these shoes um but yeah Thank you so much. Love you loads. Um, I'm leaving. Uh, what do you think about my hair? You like it? 
she's gonna be like why am i fishing for compliments but anyway do you like it um don't leave your your vlogging camera unattended otherwise some of us are gonna enjoy oh there's some perfume hmm might as well also spray her perfume because you know when she comes to my house she's like fa, 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 fa. but i already sprayed perfume so she's lucky if i hadn't i was gonna be like fa, 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 fa. okay let me go home um uh anyway thanks for having me at your place while you're not here i'm gonna leave Actually, maybe I'm going to steal a bit of porridge. I don't have food at my house. Sorry, I'm going to steal some porridge. Um, and a lunchbox. Yep. You got what I need. Where do you keep your lunchbox, dude? It's me going through people's houses and not knowing where stuff stays. Okay. There we go, found one. I am borrowing the purple one. I'll bring it back. Well, I'll give it to you when you come to my apartment. And I am stealing some food. That should be enough. Thank you so much. Some of us haven't been paid yet. Come on. Take care, Ida Fiji. I know yours has arrived. Spoiling some of us. Why don't you pay there, right, girly? Some of us are broke, broke. When we are broke, we go collecting food. Uh, where do I carry my shoes, mate? Is the bag yours or do I take? I'll just leave the bag. I mean, it's the least I can do since it was your money after all. Ciao. Ciao, CG gang. A pleasure. Pleasure for having me here. Bye. Hey, guys. After having. A busy couple of days funny friday just got back and i'm changing i didn't want to mention in this vlog because i wasn't too sure when this vlog was going up and if boys would know um so yeah she's moving so we're throwing her like a little farewell party bry so it's just like a chilled girls day so i've just changed this is going inside my coat because guys one thing about me i don't like getting cold um i'd rather be overdressed than underdressed so just put on my sneakers i'll show you guys what i'm wearing now i was in heels all day so my feet are killing me right now like they're so painful um and for someone who is not used to wearing heels like to work like on an all day basis i'm sure you know how painful my feet are and worst part is that i was wearing like court heels i'll show you guys the heels i was wearing i was wearing these now they're not that high but because they're like a court pointy um they do kind of get painful after a bit um so yeah got these like I think in 2018 when I started working from Superbalist, the only thing that's annoying is that this particular pair didn't stretch like the black pair I had. So like this part here gets a little painful after a while. And then um, I like the fact that it didn't super super stretch but I also hate the fact that it gets dirty. But it looks okay when I wear it with my suit. So I'm just waiting for my sister to pick me up and then we're going there. Um, I'm not drinking because I'm so tired and yeah I think god my sister is gonna drive so at least I don't have to drive less stress for me and guys I am back to loving this perfume I don't know why like I've used this I used this today and the, I think sometime during the week and I'm just like why did I stop loving her and as soon as I got to work, everyone was like, hmm, you smell so nice. I was just like, thank you. 
and then I'm wearing my coat I don't, I'm not sure about it still and then I'm just trying to figure out if I truly like it but I think I do let me just show you guys quickly sorry for the mess in the background but like I've got a couple of deliveries but this is basically my outfit I wore this Zara bodysuit today so I just basically changed my pants and obviously the jacket and stuff but the top is still the same makeup still the same as what it looked like today this was my makeup for the day just straightened my hair can't wait to remove this hair i'm definitely going to put it back but i just feel like my hair needs like a proper wash and deep condition so yeah this is the outfit guys i think now i love the coat I definitely love it if you're looking for affordable coats guys definitely try h&m because this is 8.99 as compared to the coats from like mango that are like priced at crazy prices and i feel like this is a perfect fit i was worried about it being long but i actually like it so yeah it's just like these gray jeans that i got from cotton on i actually need to lose weight guys there was a time when these jeans were so loose that they couldn't fit and they didn't look nice and now they kind of fit again so that's not good but yeah um this is me i think i look cute for a little girl's bra you know presentable cute i think she'll like the fact that i made an effort always make an effort guys even if you just hang out with the girls you know and obviously i wore my favorite pair this is soon going to retire and we're going to be wearing those my sister came to fetch her pair today when i was not here and apparently they fit so yeah okay guys we've arrived we have the flowers and here we are Welcome Hello. to my humble abode. So today is Boyd's Day. Today, oh, wow. I'm joined. Wow, not you blaming the entire day. <laughs> <laughs> not you blaming the entire day. Guys, so the girls are hosting me today at my place. So this place, I'm moving. Um, I'm moving to a new place. So today's my last hoorah. And you see, if the girls are preparing the food Hi, over here. Hi, Chomis. Hi, and she's from work. Oh, Chomi, bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Marinating. They're marinating the chicken. Yes. Jess is there taking care of the salads. Yes, as she yes, should. Yes, as she should. <laughs> oh, mama. Oh, mama. Oh, mama is out here. Um, yeah guys, so I'm moving, as you can see the boxes in the background over there, um, yeah. <laughs> I forgot to <you> me. <laughs> um, the girlies are here outside, hi Cord. The girls are here outside, hi. they are preparing the, the braai over there, hard labor. Yeah guys. Ziawa Ram Ganwam. How does that song go? Ziawa Ram Ganwam. Ziawa Ram. In this situation. But. Yeah. CG gang, you know where you'll always find your faith. Wherever they aspire. She's always the prime master. Bitch, now I'm gonna smell. I didn't want to smell. <laughs> Like every time there's a bride, I know <laughs> they're gonna, you're, gonna, you're gonna end up being the bride master. Imagine. Come on, you send me that side, you you're gonna see smell why it. It's good that I actually ate. No, I, I think I should make the smoke move around. I'm trying to make it light everywhere. It's crazy. <laughs> In a complex noise levels until 10. <laughs> or 11 sometimes. Yeah. Friday, 11 or midnight, you'll find. Okay. <laughs>
guys i was shooting a campaign and these are the nails i did <laughs> what do you guys think with the assistance of rue of course because she is the queen shame this is hard work guys i could never go back to doing my nails mm -mm. like this just made me appreciate her even more appreciate your nail text because it could never be me i'm sorry we're going back to our acrylic life because guys nails with no acrylic are so weak already i feel normal again